Hi, welcome back to my channel. I'm Munkesh, and uh, in this video, we are covering our next session. Uh, it's another database object, name is index. Uh, what index is doing? Ideally, you have seen index in uh, every book, and what is the use of that index is what you can easily find out. Chapter number five is located on which page. So you jump to that page directly rather than going one by one each and every page. So, so use of index is what you can print the data immediately. Uh, you are not reading the entire book. It, you can easily jump to the that particular page because of that index only. So same logic we are using in uh, Oracle SQL as well. Uh, here in one table, you have a number of columns and you can declare index on one particular column where you have multiple rows and uh, it will uh, give the good performance while executing any kind of SQL query. So how to create that index uh, that we are going to see and how to drop that index we will see in this uh, session and where we can see all index saved in our Oracle database. So just see on the screen, uh, they have given one example, a create index. Obviously, we will use create statement to create it and uh, EMP last name IDX there that name they have given on employees last name under uh, employees we have a last name column and for that last name column they have created one index and that index name is emp underscore last underscore name underscore idx so let me see and let me uh, create the same index in my oracle database uh, actually i have executed one oracle uh, sql query uh, select star from user indexes it will show you how many indexes are already exist in your database for which table and which user has created it so table owner means this user has created in this index and it is applied on these these tables so uh, even i have one more uh, table select star from emp this is what my own table which i have already created and uh, i want to create index for this emp name column so create i am putting index and uh, name of my index is emp underscore mangesh underscore index so this is name i have given uh, for which table i want to create this table name i need to mention over here and column name under bracket i need to mention let me execute this sql query now see the output so uh, i forgot to add here on clause actually reason uh, it is not created successfully see index is successfully created so for this particular column, EMP name column has multiple rows also. If rows uh, count is very high, still I will get the data immediately from that particular column because of this index only. Rather, it increases the performance of your SQL query. Now, uh, where I can find out the index details in uh, Oracle database because I will do select style from tab. I can see only uh, table view. If synonyms are synonyms, we will see in the next, but. Uh, here you cannot find out you have created this index or not. So where is this then? So you need to execute this SQL query, select star from user index user indexes. And yes, uh, find out your uh, index name over here. Uh, my table name is this. Look at this. Employee Mangesh index we created by this user and created for this table only. If you don't need of this, uh, then with the help of drop statement, you can easily delete this index permanently from your drop index and name of my index is this so this will get delete permanently from your database okay uh, we have seen how to create index and how to delete index with the help of drop statement if someone is going to ask you what is the index tell me very easily so tell them a simple definition stating that indexes allows you to search or find data fastly in the particular column without reading the entire table okay ideally if someone is going to find some uh, records in that particular table so it will find in column one column two column three column four column five if you have not given any kind of arguments so if i have given uh, index only on column three so it will skip all those columns and it will go to that particular column only and I will get my data easily and fastly. So it will increase the uh, retrieval speed also of your SQL query. So this is what the exact uh, example, except if your definition about the index. And uh, with the help of create statements, you can easily create it. Now, there is a one more database object pending from my side. Let me jump to that one as well, uh, which is a synops. 
सिनम्स हेल्प्स यू टू गिव अल्टरनेट नेम टू योर डेटाबेस ऑब्जेक्ट्स ओके देर इज अ वन मोर रीनेम स्टेटमेंट इज ऑल्सो देयर अंडर डी डी एल बट रीनेम विल यूज टू रीनेम द कॉलम हेडिंग एंड टेबल नेम ओनली बट इफ यू हैव वीव सिनॉम्स सिक्वेंस दिस डेटाबेस ऑब्जेक्ट्स एंड यू वॉन्ट टू गिव एनी अल्टरनेट हेडिंग फॉर दैट देन सिनॉम्स विल कम इन द पिक्चर इफ माई टेबल हेडिंग इज वेरी लार्ज टू मेक इट शॉर्ट आई विल गिव द सिनॉम्स सो यूज ऑफ सिनॉम इज मीन्स वॉट यू कैन गिव another name to your database objects so database objects can be anything whether it is table view or sequence index and how to give it with the help of create statement again now uh, let me show you my index is here if i want to give any shortcut name to this index i will use synonyms okay uh, create s y n y o sorry s y n Synonym spelling uh, S Y N O N Y M. <laughs> so sometimes I get confused with the synonym spellings S Y N O N Y M. And uh, create synonym. I will give a new name. So man index. This is what the shortcut name for which index E M P underscore Mangesh underscore I index. So this is what the new name i am giving and this is what my old name old name and new name both will be exist but this is only alternate synonyms you have created to access this index so let me execute this sql query guys yes now uh, do this select star from tab uh can i have see man index is showing here it is a synonyms means uh, it's a alternate name of this you can create a um, synonyms for any tables like see departments table i want to give alternate name as a d1 or only d so put how to create it this is a index i am removing this example synonym is here a new name i want to give as a d1 for which table for this table now let me execute this one you can see d1 is created select star from tab yeah i can see uh, synonym is there for man index and synonym is here for this if i'll do the select star from d1 i'll get the same data which is there in departments because it's only alternate name for that department table if all thing is good if you want to delete this synonym permanently from the database just use drop statement drop will delete drop will delete your synonyms permanently from the database okay do this select star from tab now d1 is not exist see that is already deleted i want to delete this synonym also i will use drop drop synonym and what is my synonym name is man index that will also get deleted in this way you can use the database objects and uh, we have already covered the basic about the table view then we also done with the sequence and index as well so try similar practice on your db and um, practice will make you perfect only so uh, in this video uh, that's it from my side uh, i need to start with one more video where uh, we will learn on how to use all sql statement with definition and examples i will cover and uh, one more merge statement uh, video is pending from my side so that i'll prepare in your next video and slowly slowly i'll start uploading the videos on the channel so just see on uh, see all the videos and try similar practice on your db you will automatically get perfect in your sql so that's it from my side thank you so much for watching this video see you soon